Let me start with something that might sound impossible. They told you the moment you hit puberty, your height was locked in stone. Doctor said your growth plates close. Teachers said, that's it, kid. You're stuck with what you've got. And you probably believed it. But what if I told you? They're not entirely right. What if I told you there are hacks, real science-backed methods, that can literally make you taller, straighter, and more commanding, even if you're way past 18? Sounds crazy, right? But stick with me. Because by the end of this video, you'll not only know the truth, you'll know exactly how to force your bones to grow taller, even if society swore it's impossible. Why this matters. Height is power. Whether we admit it or not, taller people are instantly perceived as more confident, more attractive, more dominant. It's unfair, but it's real. Now here's the dark side. If you don't take action, your height can actually shrink as you age. Your posture can compress, your spine can curve and you can lose up to two inches of height by your 30s or 40s. So the question is, are you going to let life take away your presence? Or are you going to fight back and reclaim the inches that belong to you? The truth you've never been told. Your growth plates may stop lengthening after puberty, yes. But your bones are not dead structures. They're alive. They remodel. They adapt. They change based on the stress you put on them. Think about it. Your muscles grow bigger with training, your brain rewires with learning. So why wouldn't your skeletal system adapt too? It can, and it does. The secret is mechanical loading, posture correction, hormonal optimization, and decompression. That's what we're diving into today. I'm going to give you seven powerful methods to literally make yourself taller. Methods that work even after puberty. Are you ready? Let's go. One, fix your spinal compression. The biggest reason most people feel short isn't genetics, it's compression. Every single day, gravity pushes down on your spine, shrinking you by up to an inch. That means the 5'9 guy in the morning is barely scraping 5'8 by night. Now imagine that compression happening for years. If you don't fight it, your spine literally molds into that shorter posture. The fix, spinal decompression exercises. Hang from a pull-up bar for two minutes a day. Practice yoga poses like cobra or upward dog. Use an inversion table if you can. Think of it like stretching out a slinky that got tangled. Once you decompress your spine daily, you'll regain lost inches and stand straighter instantly. All your seats, too. Unlock your posture muscles. Here's a harsh truth. Most people aren't actually short. They're just bent. Rounded shoulders, forward head posture, weak glutes. It's like walking around with your body permanently hunched. That posture can rob you of two, three inches of visible height. Why it matters. Your posture isn't just about looking taller. It's about signaling power. Slouched posture screams insecurity. Upright posture screams confidence. The fix, strengthen your core and glutes. Do wall angels to open your shoulders. Practice the string method. Imagine a string pulling you up from the top of your head every time you walk. Do this consistently, and not only will you look taller, you'll feel taller. Three, boost your HGH naturally. Growth hormone isn't just for kids. Even as an adult, HGH, human growth hormone, controls cell repair, bone density, and tissue growth. Low HGH weak bones, low energy, and yes, stunted height potential. The fix, trigger HGH naturally. Get deep sleep, seven, nine hours. Your body releases the most HGH at night. Do high-intensity interval training, sprints, jump squats, intermittent fasting. Yes, skipping breakfast can boost HGH by 200 300%. When HGH levels rise, your bones get denser, your cartilage thickens, and your frame supports a taller structure. Four, stretch your cartilage. Most people forget your bones aren't the only thing that affects height. Between every bone is cartilage flexible, spongy tissue that acts like a cushion. And here's the secret. Cartilage can thicken with proper stimulation. That means more space between your joints. And yes, more height. The fix. Jump rope daily to stimulate cartilage growth. Do weighted stretches like hanging with ankle weights, but start light. Hydrate like crazy. Cartilage is 80% water. And dehydration shrinks it. Think of your joints like tires. If they're flat, you look smaller. Pump them up and suddenly, you stand taller. It's five, hack your diet for bone growth. Your skeleton is literally made from what you eat. 
And most people are building theirs out of junk. Calcium isn't enough. You need a bone growth stack. Vitamin D3 from sunlight or supplements. Magnesium. Almonds. Spinach. Collagen. Bone broth supplements. Protein. At least one gram per pound of body weight. Why does this matter? Because bones remodel every 10 years. That means your skeleton today is not the same one you had a decade ago. Feed it right, and you can rebuild it stronger and taller. Now six, stretch under load, the forgotten trick. Here's where things get really interesting. Bones respond to mechanical stress. That's why astronauts lose bone density in space. They don't have gravity pressing on them. So if you want to force bones to adapt, you need to load them strategically. The fix, do exercises like squats, deadlifts, and farmer's carries. Combine that with stretching under load, light ankle weights while hanging. Train explosively, jumps, sprints, bounding. This stimulates micro-stretching in your bones and cartilage, forcing them to adapt by lengthening over time. 7. Elongate while you sleep. This is the hack nobody talks about. Your body repairs itself most during deep sleep. If you want maximum height gains, you need to set up your sleep like an elite athlete. The fix. Sleep on a firm mattress. Soft beds sink your spine. Ditch the pillow or use a thin one to keep your neck aligned. Try the tall man sleep position. Flat on your back, arms by your side, legs extended. This prevents spinal compression overnight and helps your body recover in a lengthened state. The bonus factor, confidence multiplies height. Here's the final truth. Even if you gain just one or two inches physically, the way you carry yourself can make you appear five inches taller. Think about someone you know who isn't tall, but commands every room they walk into. That's presence. That's energy. So yes, use these hacks to literally force your bones and joints to adapt. But don't forget the invisible factor, your mindset. Because the moment you stop obsessing over your limitations and start acting taller, the world treats you like you are taller. Motivational climax. You've been lied to. They told you height was fixed. They told you you had no choice. But you just learned the truth. Your body is alive. Your bones are not static. They respond. They adapt. They grow. So the only real question is, are you going to sit there, hunched over, accepting the inches you've lost? Or are you going to fight back? Stretch, strengthen, eat, sleep, and rise to your full potential. Because this isn't just about height. This is about refusing to let anyone put a limit on you. Not doctors. Not teachers. Not even biology. You are taller than you think. And now, it's time to prove it. Call to action. If this video lit a fire inside you, don't just watch and scroll. Take action today. Pick one of the hacks and do it right now. Hang from a bar, fix your posture, or chug a glass of water. And if you're serious about transforming your body, subscribe for more science-backed hacks that challenge what you've been told is impossible. Because this isn't the end of your growth story, it's just the beginning. Stand tall, stay relentless, and I'll see you in the next one.